In talking with bankers around the area, I've found out that even though banks do have the ability to make SBA loans, they're reluctant to. Why is that? <laughs> well, again, you asked me to, to speak about why the banks, but I would say that one of the ideas is you are talking about an SBA guaranteed loan. You're talking about a federal program. You're talking about asking the banks to do substantial paperwork, documentation, that they may or may not feel comfortable having to do that kind of paperwork. And for them, if they can make the loan on their own without having SBA literally looking over their shoulders, uh, perhaps that could be a reason. Okay, good. What are the most important criteria the banks and the SBA look for then in making a decision about a loan? Gosh, um, you know, there are so many factors that go into approving a loan that the bank and the SBA look at. Uh, Oh, just to give you a real quick list would be obviously financial statements. They, the bank and the SBA will look at the financial statement and run so, certain ratios. What is the debt to net worth? What is the current ratio? Uh, but the most important thing is repayment ability. Is the business profitable? Is it going to be able to service some additional debt? And so cash flow is, is to me would be the most important uh, factor that we look at. I know the SBA, if it doesn't have the ability to repay, there's no way we're going to guarantee the loan. And the chances are the bank would have never sent it to us if they also felt that the loan was not going to be made. Mm -hmm. uh, now, if it's an existing business, we look at a historical to try to determine the future. What becomes very difficult is if you're talking about a startup business, it doesn't have a historical history. So in that case, we look at the business plan and we look at financial projections and we try to look at those financial projections and try to uh, make a determination, are they realistic, are they attainable? And if we feel that they are, well then we'll also guarantee those uh, startup businesses. Mm -hmm. A lot of banks, I'm told, will not even consider startups <laughs> for bank loans or SBA loans. Is well, that true? Some <laughs> banks, you know, and again it depends on the bank's policy. That is a true statement. Many banks will say, if you have not been in business one year or more, we just can't make you a loan. However, many of them will say, however, if the SBA will guarantee it, now we'll make you the loan. So that's where we fit in. We make those loans that without our guarantee, the loan probably would have never been made. Mm -hmm. And that's a good example of us coming in to, to solve that exception to the policy. Still, the bank will have some liability, yes, uh, and they might not want to take that even with the SBA. That is guarantee, absolutely right? correct. Sometimes our borrowers want to know why would the bank not want to make it even with the SBA guarantee. Well, the bank has the the right to say we don't want to make this loan with or without an SBA guarantee, mm -hmm. because even though their risk is reduced, there is still a risk to the bank, depending on how much we guaranteed. If it was a million dollar loan and we guaranteed 75 percent, we're only going to pay maximum of 750000 so the bank is still at risk $250,000. Mm -hmm. Now this is also assuming that nothing was collected. Obviously there was some collateral that was liquidated and applied to the loan. Mm -hmm. So you're correct, yes, there are some instances where the bank will not guarantee the loan. And the only advice we would give our borrowers at that time is perhaps try another bank or perhaps talk to us and maybe we can try to determine why is it that the bank doesn't want to make you the loan. Another thing, Jerry, that, that is really not a common known fact is within a given bank, there may be certain industries that their history tells them took a loss of $500,000 on a restaurant. And you walk in and you say, Mr. Banker, I want to open a restaurant. Well, the, even though they're not supposed to look at you based on what happened to them in the past, we know that it's human nature that they may say, this bank has had an experience of too many bad loans in this industry. So in that case, if you were going to open a restaurant, I would go to another restaurant and say, where do you bank? Where did you get your loan? Because it gives you an indication that that other bank may be more restaurant friendly, mm -hmm. using that for an example. Could there